Bill O'Reilly. And, okay, Joy, you okay, had something okay, on your mind. I want to talk about the Republican Party a little bit, right, right of center, et cetera, uh, and on uh, talk television, talk radio, okay? So Glenn Beck had a big, big spread in the New York Times said in the front page that he is a hot pistol. You weren't in that. Um, Rush Limbaugh is considered, like, the de facto head of the Republican Party. Are you jealous? Are you upset? Do you feel resentful? Speak to us. <laughs> Vent, if you will. Well, we're going to how do you really you. feel? <laughs> what do you think? Crushed. Tell us how you feel. I'm crushed. Um, Beck is a good guy. He's very entertaining on he's television. Not, and uh, I use him on Friday on my program. Mm -hmm. and he's he's very entertaining. Uh, Limbaugh, I don't know very much. You know, I, I don't get to listen to a show because I'm working at that right. time. Mm -hmm. um, Does he, he deserve to be the kind of influence that he seems to have I, come? Listen, I don't know. I mean, it's a free marketplace. You know, Do are you people forcing people to listen to Rush Limbaugh? Do they come, you better listen, Barbara, to Rush Limbaugh. I'm going to blow up your car. He's got a strong no, point. I mean, if they want to listen to no, him, let them listen to him. What about the Republican uh, leaders, so called, who have yeah. been. What Republican uh, leaders? Well, Michael, Michael Steele, Steel. for example, who have been no. apologizing to Rush for saying, you know, that he shouldn't like be saying those things. He apologized to Rush. Embarrassing to the Republican Party for that to be happening? I'm embarrassed. Every party embarrasses me. Well, I mean, right I think they're all a bunch of people. Yes, what about not my party? Now, that's, see, oh, you're not a Republican. A, no, I'm a registered independent. Okay. Yeah, I've been for many, many yes, years. Right. See? The, Joy, you got to I can down. register anything. Don't be a poppin' jet, all right? But I don't want you a poppin' jet. I don't want you being a poppin' jet. What the right? hell is a poppin' jet? <laughs> we'll look it up Back in the break. Um, what did you think, talking about how, you know, television appearances, et cetera, um, when President Obama went on Jay Leno and made that remark about the Special Olympics, yeah. and it was sort of quickly glossed over, I thought, in the media. Not did really, you think that... Do you, you think, him, no, 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 I'm you saying, do you think there is, there is a general feeling out there that, say, it was President Bush, former Look, President Bush, all of this it would have been nailed... I think this gotcha stuff is nonsense, all right? Look, President Obama goes on, yep. and, he, and he makes a, a joke that he thinks is self-deprecating, and it sure. doesn't come out that way. Sure. Is you President Obama that. trying to denigrate people who are mentally challenged? No. 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 So why do we make a big deal out of it? Because we don't have anything better to do. Okay, That's now. why. So let's stop this. Well, let's stop it. Let me ask you. Go ahead. Uh, we were talking before, uh, during commercial, about... Uh, what do you call it, talk radio and all those kind of things. Mm -hmm. You mentioned an interesting thing. You thought it was lessening because of things like Look, Twitter. Twitter business, mm -hmm. all right, this means that every American, all 330 million of us, mm -hmm. all right, can produce our own talk radio shows. Good we can us. Twitter the day away Very like this. Good. Good Why good do we us. have to listen to That's you, great. to me, hey, or no, anybody? It's a free market. What? That's right. It's a free market. So this now, with the younger people going into this kind of stuff, they don't have time to listen to talk radio mm -hmm. or do a lot of other things. Mm -hmm. I don't I don't think that's really good. I don't think spending no. your whole life twittering about the color of your couch is going to advance you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What you're, what you're saying, oh. Mr. Bale, what you're okay. saying then, hang on, let's just hear me out. What you're saying yes. then is then what you may have to say seems to be more important than what the average Joe has to say. I think everyone, everyone's I have a actions research of what staff, they're Elizabeth, doing. Elizabeth, of 15. Are, look, all right, that Bill, are getting that are getting to the my, bottom of complicated questions. If my questions. friend Sherry wants yes. to ask a question and finds concern with Dennis Rodman's um, issue yeah. and his alcoholism, I think that's equally important. Just don't important make it dominating in your it's life. Not, it is a free market, and yeah. I think it's up to every individual to, to manage their life. If you're here's working out, if you're drinking, if you're twittering, moderation. Okay. Hello. Uh, if you could interview Barack Obama now, we have Afghanistan, we have General Motors, we have surplus. What would you ask him? You've had him on before. Well, Obama's got to stop spending money. That's number one. That, that's the biggest threat to the country right now. It's got to stop. I understand why he did what he did. All right. And uh, I didn't see the numbers, so I don't know whether I would have done the same thing. But certainly when George Bush and Barack Obama agree that the economy's heading for a cliff, you got to take it seriously. OK, so he did what he did. But enough. But That's does it. anybody have a better That's idea? It. No one seems to have a better matter, idea. Matter, you've got to stop now. Stop. All right, and then what solidify. Should stop? Where should stop, stop spending should money. We can't spend any more money on anything. It's got to be a fiscal freeze now. Stop. Go to California. California's almost bankrupt. Arnold is going to topple into the Pacific Ocean any any second. <laughs> they don't have any money. Look at that as your model. That is an entitlement society. 
out of control spending. You want the whole country to be like that? What do you mean entitlement society? Explain it's too so much spending know. on pe giving people stuff. It right. comes down to giving well, people then, stuff. What, what about the war in Iraq? Sorry. That spend, well, that look, cost stop us with a lot of money. Stop with that. That's That was a trillion. Let's stop with Iraq. Let's go to Afghanistan. Let's go to Afghanistan. Afghanistan what? We're just going to need money. You're going to have to spend some money there. Do you go crazy spending money there? No. You have to have a defense. You have to have money allotted for people who need it, who are dying. You have to have it. But your social security is bankrupt health, now. What about health You care? can't expand health care right now. Don't have the money. Whoopee, me yes. and you can't afford to pay for everybody's health care. Well, and me, that's who it's coming what down to. Me Am I some poor schmuck? No, but you... <laughs> We're the big earners but, here. Know. This is the big earner yeah, triad yeah, here. I'm not sure. I got that. Oh, don't, don't give me any of that. Bill, I want to I I bring it to a little bit of a, a lighter subject yeah, really quickly. All right. um, you have been, we recently had Meghan McCain on the show. Right. And she responded to Laura Ingram's uh, plus size comments. Yeah, to kiss her butt or something like yes, that? Yes, and the fact that she yes. couldn't yes. get on yeah. American yeah. Idol. But good. now you've been Before asking for her to come on your show and she's, she hasn't returned She's afraid to come on my show. Why is she afraid to come I don't know why. I think she looks like a nice. No, no, no. She's Megan. busy. Okay. She's like I know she's busy. She's yeah. Twitter. Twitter. No, Twitter. I love Elizabeth. She's not too busy to come here, but she's too busy to come here. Maybe her nights are busy. Well, her Laura, days are Ingram, great. Laura Ingram is your friend. So how do you feel about her? What she said. She, look. Yeah. People get attention yeah. by attacking other people. No. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. we're not going to okay. have any more attention so, now. We do. And that's why you're yes. on longer we than anybody else. We try to keep else. it on the issues. Okay. And I, you know, whether Megan's butt is bigger, I don't care. Okay. It doesn't matter to me. You heard it right here. There you go. You will not catch Bill O'Reilly on Twitter, but you will catch him on the O'Reilly Factor weeknights on Fox News. We want to thank you for coming All by. All right. Always fun. Ladies. We'll be right back to Grateful Dead.